What is this quick save thing anyway? Yeah, let's switch characters. Is at three. All right. I guess you can get the gloves. Is 
to double check. I'm pretty sure there's nothing I can forge. Took your time, huh? I've been waiting. One night is fit. Let's go get ourselves a dragon. What's up, X Dragon? God damn it. It's his capture card. That should fix it. Shots of pebblers. even thinking, let me take out the owl before it decides to want to confuse somebody. And then it confused somebody. Pretty much. Is that... I don't think I have any level 4 weapons. Take the whip, because we're going to need that soon. Might as well have it equipped on somebody. I'm trying to remember what else is in this cave. Like, do I go straight to using the whip, or do I go... Yeah, I go straight to the... Well, there's something else for... You know, I do the whip first.
I'm like really staring at the map now. I don't think there's any orbs hiding in this cave. Outside of the one from the boss. Our armor is good enough for the pebblers now. Sprite's hit points could uh, use a little boost though. That doesn't look like a staircase in this version. The owl is easy XP, even if the enemy generator isn't. Grinding out the magic level is definitely good for just the level of XP anyway. Whoa, what? Is there like a level 2 pile driver now? Are gloves now like accidentally the best weapon in the game because I can just throw everything? I want to say this is a lightning bolt. It is not a lightning bolt. I think I might have been able to get away with a gem missile on it too, but oh well. Looks like a power bomb, right? Well, it's just good to be back on this, I guess. And that clears this out. Okay. Air blast. Air blast. Oh, yeah. Now it, you have to go. Next, I'm gonna put the sword there. You still don't use the trident at all. Get with the program. All right. 
I feel like I didn't go to some rooms in this place. But I also don't really remember finding a lot of uh, things in this cave in the past. Where there was another cave before uh, getting to the dragon. The viper, whatever we're calling it. Supposed to be open yet. Nice. Oh. Lob lightning bolts at it. Let's go. I was gonna say, why didn't Sprite's hit points go up? I'm a little scared. You only have like a thousand hit points, right? Yeah, there it is. Girl leveled. You can get onto that platform somehow. This is the legendary white dragon? We made it look like toothless. Oh. No, its parents must not have survived that monster from earlier. We can't just leave it here. I know it that's the line, it but own. it's like I can't believe a dragon couldn't take down the snake that we just kind of zapped. But it's too big for us to carry around, and this one's just a baby. We should ask Truffle what to do. Slow you down. Don't worry, I'll raise it for you. K -k 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 King Truffle! Shh, shh, shh. I've made up my mind. You three have stuff to do, right? Leave the rest to me. Sorry for taking up your time. Stop by if you get the chance and say hi to the little fella. By the way, how do you like the name Flammy? It's settled. We'll call him Flammy. Cannon Travel is open again south of the forest. Visit the Fire Palace in the Kakara Desert. If you're on the search for palaces, that's the closest one. Good luck! Aww. Isn't he cute? Took your time, huh? Watts, you sound way too confident for the sad music. I've been waiting! Now that's not what it was called. We're busy renaming swords. I'm a little scared about what comes next. Because the fifth one's supposed to be Excalibur. Sixth one's supposed to be Masamune. One night is 50. Seventh one, I have no memory. The eighth one's the Dragon Blade. Yeah, getting shrunk is basically harmless in this game because it either wears off fast and against bosses, you just smack them around with magic anyway. I'm trying to remember now how big the 400 was, because I remember this game, it's like 50. You had normal 0 to 49, then 50 up to 199, and then 200 and up. Like, the numbers got bigger and bigger. We didn't use any items.
clear out this room. Or whatever experience it's worth. There's a can travel in this forest, I think. Or do we have to go all the way back to summer? Yeah. Hey, hey! This is a desert, huh? Uh, I, I, I'm not too sure about this, but uh, we'll, we'll, we'll give it a try. Uh, just pop yourself into the barrel. I missed what the choices were because I was getting ready to mash through the text. Remember when you got to see the overworld with cannon travel? The war against overworlds continues. Just wait till we get flammy, I guess. Look, there's sand everywhere. I hate sand. It's so barren. Well, let's find a town before we shrivel up. Remember the original game, you just pick a side, go up, and go back to the center. And the ship appears. I kind of want to pick a side and go up as far as I can just to see what happens. still kind of bad. Whoa! When did that happen? The desert is in a black screen. Yeah, it's not. Pumpkin bombs. keep the hit points up because once we're on the ship we're gonna get healed anyway. And what's the guy's name? Gestar? I guess we'll find out how they want to pronounce it pretty soon. Has an X for its eye.
All right, so I think we're we're proving that going straight up, 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 up is the possible thing. Gotta raise this anyway, right? Magic just owns everything in this game, for better or worse. Okay, it does have to be up like a number of screens. And I recognize that like the uh, the first screen I went onto had the sand stingers too. place for it now. I guess I did a little bit. Oh, that confirms you have to wait for the uh, the enemy to disappear before the XP happens. I think that was the other option from earlier. this going still. There's a possibility they were simply lost in the desert. Uh, we'd almost given up. I see. I'll help you, stranger. But in return, you'll have to work off your debt. Uh-oh. You'll work in the engine room, the shrimp will take kitchen duty, and the lady comes with me. Oh. I'm sorry. Didn't you hear what I said? Move! Make a living pillaging and plundering. Oh, poor pirate. Can't pillage anymore. But I can't forget the feel of the waves and the salt spray in the air. That's why I stowed away on this ship. Ah! 
I'll be back on the high seas someday. Mark my word. Huh? Leave it to me. You, get back I think this boat. is probably a sand ship edition of this music too, which didn't Help! exist separately. Fire! Look at how out of the way they are now. I think they moved like straight up through you last time. They split us up on the ship. Sprite's here in the ship, and the lady went with the general, as they said. You offended there? Get him out of here! No thanks. Couldn't... Run. <laughs> Eat another bite. All the food in the hole's been devoured! You offended there? I just want to like this is this is much more desert sandy like or at least like shippy as opposed to regal you gotta find pink hey look it's that door I ran right by All right, I guess I'm gonna take a chance and not save. Oh no! Rats have eaten all the food in the galley. It can't be. Rats have eaten all the food. Oh no! Yo, what's up, Cuckoo? Rats, huh? Well, you can't see in the original game. The sprite had the kind of like laughing uh, sprite animation. The sprite had a sprite. Massage my shoulder. Uh oh. You wish? I'd rather eat sand. And we hate sand. Spoiled brat. You want some? Come and get it. Maury, stop this ridiculousness now. But Gramps, she disobeyed. <laughs> no more pathetic excuses, Maury. You there, get out. Don't have to tell me twice. Am I glad to see you guys? Have you heard this creep? They've escaped. Now what do we do, Gramps? Oh, um, escapees. Grab them. <laughs> Eventually realizing, wait, this is his ship. Whoa, what? It's the Empire. They're attacking. Ah! No, no, I don't want to die. Let's surrender. Idiot. You call yourself a soldier? Man, to your battle station. No way. We're with glory. Let's get out of here. Guys thought they were on a cushy job out in the desert. Surrender. Drat. Surrender. There's our, our literal boy, Gestar. Can we talk to him from here? We have to... What a coincidence. I didn't think I'd see you. Oh, that's right. We've already seen him once. Thanatos' emissary warned me about a group of meddlesome travelers. He must have meant travelers. Yeah, yeah I know, Sand. Shall we go for a round? This is the end! Oh. Let's ah! <laughs> speed things up! You know what? Let's do it. Win. Zap them! <laughs> I could use slow down, but we got a missile coming in now. 
The moment the fire guy gets cheesed me a little bit. The possibility of me not cheesing bosses was basically over. They are scared of two teenagers and a small child. It's true. Yo! I'm gonna... Give me a minute. I can do that later, I guess. We'll go to the Twitters. Yo, levels went up because I see 17 magic points. I don't know how he had an orb. <laughs> you fellas are a hoot. Look me up if you're interested. I fear if we ever and see him again. Our country is sent. Are you leaving? Not yet. If it wasn't for our passengers, we would have been goners. We owe them a debt. What? You know Gemma? But that means you're heroes. I apologize for my grandson's foolish actions. Oh, man. He'll get what's coming to him. I'd almost forgotten how true soldiers are meant to behave. Thank you for reminding me. No! What? Have you no shame? Go north from here and you'll find the oasis. Our country is... Are you leaving? Go north of here. So as promised, I think we're going to get to see Ice Country today. Welcome to Kakara. Let's get the important thing done I'm first. I'm about to pass out from this heat! I'll try not to melt before I upgrade your weapon. I've been waiting. You got a whip, right? He's reforging a whip. Welcome. What? Oh boy. I want to say this is the same stuff as it is on the other side of the of the uh, cannon. They felt they stay true to a lot of it. It's the translation so far that's a little like interestingly different. Again. Oh, I want to be here. Well, let's get to the equipment menu. I'll leave that there for just a moment. All the shopkeepers dance well. It's the best okay. part of this, these games. All right, yeah, but the TR is worse. And I need chocolate. Anything else? Anything else? I guess we can sell everything now too. Best drop from the self tales. Anything else? Come again. Everything else is set up properly. Alright, we did everything. I don't think there's anything that happens Someone's here. Someone's nabbed south. What's more? We need to get the rat tail later or something like that to restore the oasis. One night is... Oh, do we get a skit now? We haven't seen one for the whole Upper Lands. Wow, hard to think that I didn't know about the mana seeds up until now. 
and that there are bad people in the world trying to use them for their own nefarious purposes. Nefarious. I think I'm finally starting to understand how important these seeds are. Tropical Christmas paradise, yeah. I was just tagging along, but I'm going to see this whole thing through. If Dylek were here, he'd protect the mana seeds too. Yeah. We gotta step up and stop wrongdoing when we see it. I don't know if that'll save the world, but it's a start. The best part about Mana Trilogy, Dancing Shop. You're keeps, getting yeah. more responsible by the day. I'm impressed. You, you think? Not by much, but at least you're not whimpering at the sight of goblins anymore. Got him. Still going on about that? Huh. Well, better get a move on. There's still Dialog and Pamela to save after all. Guys, I've been thinking. Maybe people aren't stealing the mana seeds to eat them. I think they're on to something. You're the only one thinking about eating mana seeds. Uh, the blue-haired girl at the ruins is uh, Pamela. I always figured it was like Pamela or like a Miss... whatever. It's been so long, right? And she's such a minor character, I never really paid much attention to her name. Fama. Fana. You're right. There was an H in there. So it, it's like little things like that in the translation that are different. And like they chain, they dropped the time flows like a river before history repeats in the opening. Hello, hello. Welcome, so it's like, welcome. it's a lot of stuff that's nothing serious and the Don't game itself cold, still it? plays like the game. With a couple of, couple of minor tweaks, but it's still the game. I know, right? It's stuff like that. I've got to get through this because I've got, um... Oh yeah, they took out the cannon travel animation, which bothers me. We've got this for later. Hooray for green screen, right? Um... Once I get through this, Trials of Mana goes in. It's like One an ice night is thing back there. I swear, I slept at that Inn of Mantango how many times and we didn't get any of these? How'd those losers end up with a cool name like Scorpion Army anyway? You think it's cool? It is a cool name. I got it! We should give our group a name too! Okay. Brave Asperia. I vote no. I guess I don't mind. As long as it's cool. Hear that, sis? Bro's on the same wavelength. What name were you thinking? Hell yeah! No way, no how, nah. -uh. Why would we be a part of a sprite army? Ah, uh, come on. Next. Fine. The bossy witch army. Yo. No. If anything, it should be the radiant magician army, or maybe pure maiden party. Uh, I don't like either of those, honestly. I didn't expect. Radiant to be is so cooler. Picky. I like brave swordsman brigade. Three words. If it's not alliterative, it's not going to work. The Brave Brigade is actually a good one. Enough! This is dumb! I guess we'll just have to stick with the boss and their dumb underlings. Since when are we called that? That's a good band name, actually. Up next on stage, we've got the boss and their dumb underlings. I like that they threw, threw these skits in. We've got like the tail skits. I'm... Things are getting hot around here. The more the ice melts, the harder it is to carve out a living. This... Alright, let's go rescue uh, Salamander. And then... The traditional leveling of the new elemental. Huh. 
Poor wolfies. Granted, my memory is basically that these wolves just own you for a long time. Maybe it's because I'm actually like leveled properly right now. the ballooner. Hot and hard. Life is rough. It was a three-player game. This one is multiplayer. I was able to get a second controller to pop in. I haven't uh, tried to actually play with it, though. Outside of testing out the uh, weapon charging glitch to some extent. Which I'm not even sure I remember how to do properly. Yeah, I think everybody who was alive back then and who could get their hands on a multi-tap played this game three-player. That's why I played this game so much. This game was that rare. Like, I rented it a few times, and I think it took a year before I talked my mom into buying it. So he had fun with it. Surprised these wolves are not like just owning us because that's basically their job. surprised that the uh, the peddlers are still here because it's like this is the third like set of things for them Let's get out of here peddler why are you still here now it's the turtles that are like unkillable Is that fast? Oh yeah, the minimap is actually a really nice touch. When I first saw it, do you want the minimap on or off? I'm like, do I really need a minimap? Oh god, this thing. And then once you actually see the minimap is the SNES graphics, it's like, oh, that's beautiful. <laughs> Thanks. Less of a run and more of a playthrough. Hope you're right. the rest of your day is good, though. Let's go kill a plant. I forget what the name of Tropicalo's evil twin here is. I believe Earth Slide is, is the answer here. Oh god. Take more than that. Healing power of my feet. Pure water.
that was the Final Fantasy adventure. It took me until like the middle of high school to figure out that those games existed and that they were mana games. Well, Trials, right? Secret Everybody was looking for Secret of Mana 2 in the 90s. And we were all mad that it basically never appeared. How are we doing? And are we about to start digging into the fairy walnuts for the first boss? No, we got this. I can't believe we did that much damage in one hit. That was like basically half its remaining hit points. There we go. I only ever beat Trials of Mana in Japanese way back in the day, so I like didn't get much of anything out of it. It was a fun game, but I was very confused. Bow. Yep. Trials has three final bosses. It depends on what your char first character is. The Dark Palace is different too, for where you find the Dark Seed. Have we met? No? Never mind. I need you to watch this stuff. Look Just for the Black Rabbi. If it cools down, I'm counting on you. I heard something. Should I open it? Ooh, thanks. I'm the fire elemental salamander. That's how he always introduces himself. Use me as a Themself? heater, huh? Well, they'll get more heat than they bargained for. Oh. Need firepower? I've got to cover. Go crazy. Burn the whole place down. Burn to the ground. I think my real question is how did they capture Salamando? Huh? The seed from the fire palace? How should I know? I've had enough of mana seeds. We saw some weird old coot when we nabbed Salamando. What are you doing? Don't help them! Uh, you won't get away with this! Oh, is that where it is? The big secret thing I know about is the Black Rabbi is in some of the final dungeons, at least. that off then what's her jab javelin's at three bow it is you're gonna get bow to four get out of here howler seriously Status. Next level in a lot for everybody. Come, 
Buster gas. I was really happy when I got Salamando back in the day because it meant the girl could go on offense with magic. Because up until this point, like the best you had was uh, Balloon. Ghosts. Yeah, the turtles are rough. Let's get out of here. Uh. Now the wolves no. are suddenly playing Not offense. Best. I'm glad that they let you just run now. You don't have to like run in a straight line, recharge, and then run again. One night is fifty. Nothing beats cannon travel. <laughs> What's up? Just remembering the thrill of being shot straight into the air. I could get used to that. Yeah, but the land is fun, huh? Can we go back to the cannons again tomorrow? Can we? Can we put the cannons into mode seven? Sure, if it's on the way. There's no need to use cannon travel all the time. We should save money when we can. Cannon travels cost 50. We have five digits of gold. She's got a point. Aw, spoiled sport. Do you have something against cannons? No, no, no. And I'm definitely not afraid of them. If that's what you mean. Huh. <laughs> oh, prove it. Let's go for a cannon ride tomorrow. Fine. I'll go anywhere you pick. Great, it's settled. Hmm? Something wrong, bro? What about the money? My pride is more important than money. Huh. What are we waiting for? Uh-oh. I awoke the witch within. Will you quit calling me a witch? Let's get some rest. I Someone's going to figure out what you're talking PLA about again. every time you say witch. Whip it good. All right, quick break. It's that time again. Well, this is armor, not forge. Oh, he's here anyway. How do you keep beating us to places? Oh, 
Two salamanders on the screen. Such is the magic leveling system of this game. Three enemies on screen because one of them just went down. You just leveled. Out of here, stupid wolf. This attack is down. Come, it's very, very down. Take the free set of magic points and put him to work, right? Okay, yeah, they're all down. There are footprints on the snow. Nice. Yeah. Convenient that the fire elemental got caught in the ice country. One night is 50. See, I have 23,000 gold and they're worried about spending 50. This is Sprite Village. It's great. I mean, I only just got my memory back, but I'm pretty sure it's great. I mean, did, was there a bug in the game last time that I never got these? You'll be home before you know it. Just a little farther. You always know what to say, bro. Thanks. You're not usually so sincere. It's like seeing snow in the summer. Like here. There's snow year round in the forest near my home, you know. Don't be so pedantic. So what's going to happen once we arrive? Are you planning on leaving the group? It would be a lot quieter around here. I don't know. As your boss, I'm not sure if you'll be okay without me to look after you. Thanks for your concern. We can always decide once we get there. First things first. We need... Yeah, I hope everyone at home is okay. Oh, God. I'm sure they're fine. Definitely. They're very, very dead. Thanks, guys. We saw Thanks. this already. The game's catch... Oh, my God. Report the bugs. 
If only because I definitely slept at inns and didn't get anything. Most of the way to level three, level two at least. Same there. They've sent the same number of magic points. So you've got all three up. You just need to keep. There's like one other boss in the entire game that Undine's good against, and that always bothered me about this game. Like the first set of spells you get are the most useless. Energy drain's a nice like emergency heal, but that's really all you get out of it with the sprite. God, there's a 200 number. Um, what do you need to raise? Sword, boomerang. Yeah, I guess that's really it. Thank you for hanging out during, uh, you know, super fun magic leveling time. Where we raise magic and weapon levels by spamming magic. I just want to know how you get so much money for doing this in the forest. Right? Like, I understand the uh, concept of, like, Magic, po magic points in video games and, you know, we're just gonna do things. And this is kind of how it works. But it always just feels weird. There, get, get this one. Just a blaze. Weapons up. Trident. Oh, fun. have a red tip good I thought for a second the red w the weapon would not be glowing red one night is 50 GP if you were a fantasy shopkeep would you actually say GP the forest of seasons is amazing I know I think it's the forest's fault. I'm always hungry. Wait, dude, I did the same thing in Mantango and I didn't get any of these. The forest is sectioned off into the four seasons, right? That means it's probably because there's no table right for them to sit around. Aha! Uh -huh. Winter fish runs, spring fruit picking, and all the summer and fall harvests in between. We've got it all. Ugh, I'm getting hungry just thinking about it. I'm getting hungry just hearing about it. Mm. Good. Uh, time for this. Mm, you're right. But food's delicious. I'm actually kind of hungry myself. Like sometime soon I'm going to have to deal with food.
Killer robots with deadly double tapping magic abilities. Oh my god, I just completely lost track of what I was thinking about. Point is, we need to get Salamando to level 3. And with level 2 fireballs have a different animation, if I recall it correctly. This look the same. the cast a spell button, nothing's happening. This boomerang animation is going to be silly because if I can't cast spells during that, it's like going to be as soon as I get out of a section like this, get the boomerang the hell away from her. What helped out last time was I got that level right in between. So I was able to really kind of get some extra magic out of it. Pause the game to summon her. That's actually the biggest positive change. The fact that uh, if you pause, and you, party, you can get party members off screen, and then you can pause to bring them back on screen. Come on. Later on in the game, I feel better about using uh, fairy walnuts while grinding out the magic levels. One night is. The thing is, this is like the spot in the game for the rest of the game. I end up doing it. I think. Although sometimes it's okay to go to Mantango because you might get a fairy walnut drop. Pretty much. What was it like to live in the village? Did you have... Yeah. Did you always have an attitude? Or was it because of the memory loss? Ouch! That hurts my ego. I've always been known as a kind and caring sprite, thank you. <laughs> Says who? When the villagers were off in the forest collecting herbs, I found a special one and took it to Grandpa. He told me it was a rare medicinal plant, so I figured he wanted it. Sounds like you have the village's interests at heart, especially if you took it straight to your Grandpa. Is that the whole story? Did you end up giving it to him? He wouldn't take it. What? Probably because I charged him for it. It was a rare plant, after all. You charged your own grandfather money for a weed? Hey, it was compensation. A finder's fee for discovering it in the first place. Oh, man. Guess the amnesia didn't change you at all. How are we doing on magic levels, everybody? Oh, we're gonna get there. We might get Undine up to three, too, finally. Because that's the last one that's not at three. Sprite's Undine.
No despawning enemies. These long animation times. This run. These are level three fireballs now. Yep. Finish the job here. She is. It's just that much easier to do it from here. Attack is certainly down. We didn't get you all the way up. Oh, come on, video game. I mean, that's just how it's going to be for Undun. It's going to keep slightly going up. Slightly going up. I guess what I might do is I I can toggle the item maxes whenever I want. So I could probably turn the, the max for fairy walnuts up. To, like, a lot. For grinds. Watch out for mush booms. Their spores clog the air and make it hard to breathe. Too true. I've had lots of run-ins with mush booms. Tell me about it. Makes me wonder why the Matango branch of the family smells so sweet. This whole country is fragrant. This whole country. So you're supposed to be able to get them there, because it says this. Yeah, the smell kind of makes me hungry. Weird, but I think I get where you're coming from. Oh, you guys too? You agree? It smells like savory mushrooms getting roasted on hot coals. Now I can't stop thinking about it. Eat the mushroom king. Same here. Hey, do you think the Matango people would... Stop. Don't go there. We're getting into dangerous territory as it is. Yeah. Y yeah. Just enjoy the fragrance while it lasts. They're both up to three. We could probably bust through here now. This is the first uh, rather long stretch of the game. Is everything up until now, like the longest thing was really like the Earth Palace. Maybe the Witch. Eh, the Witch is a long stretch too. Fire saver still going. Boomerang's not red though. It's bothering me. Kind of happy that they made it so that you can uh, solve 
the chest and three enemies on the screen problem. They're, they're keeping it capped at three enemies. But chests now no longer count against the cap. I'm not sure about the javelin hitting two enemies. Be at three. Boomerang's at three. Um. Wow, I'm starting to slowly run out of options. Sword. And now we're really just connecting with this. Turtles are definitely turtles and crabs are both enemies in this game that are not very dangerous until they are. You just have to stay away from them. These clouds are actually really super dangerous. As they do that. are we to a level right now anyway close enough I'm gonna throw the ice ball around it's gonna get the level oh my god ice ball I mean acid rain problem. See the magma wave animation. That's not changed. 
And there's the level. See, yeah, part of the whole thing was if we got the other uh, level there, we could do that. Bow to three. Nico. So cold. What can I do for you? You don't have anything do new here, I think. Yeah, that all looks pretty familiar. Anything epic be seeing new? Have I been going around without a raccoon cap on this guy? There we go. Ow. Let's get away from that. That's a minor disaster waiting to happen up there. Gases especially are just like lob a fireball at him. Get him out of the way. They move a lot faster when they do that now in this game. Unless it feels like it. That's the smooth and groove edition of this. Fighting these guys one at a time isn't too bad. Does Javelin go to three or four? Three. Oh, thank God. The boomerang is occupied. I have to pick a weapon. Also get to pick a weapon.
You have the you have a few weapons to choose from after this. up the other way. This is the library? Oh, blue slimes. Still alive. I was gonna say, how many hit points does the blue drop have? so long since I've been in here. Point scale. You think there's an achievement for killing one of every type of enemy? I guess because it's a PlayStation game. See what, where I'm going. Nice. Let me 
next level and soon. Can we get away with a magna wave to kill this ghost? Grabbing on animation. I can't remember if this was ever a hard fight. We did it. more sinister although I guess it's like you can see the green flames on the skulls better here whereas in the original game I guess it is there you just never pay attention to it I don't want to waste magic points right now. I don't want to do that either. This might not be the best end, best uh, room to grind out a fight in. for this place to put the bow on.
Vivon! Foolish children! You must be taught a lesson! Come! Stagger these. Jeez. I honestly didn't think I was going to completely clear ice country tonight. Today. The Salamando leveling went really fast. What are you? Master! Master Claus! Are you all right? Oh, Rudolph. Sorry to have worried you. I'm fine now. It was me. I became a Frost Gigas. Lately, Gigas. the little kids no longer believe in me. It's the fading manner. Without it, children will continue to lose their fanciful hopes. I wanted to bring back their innocent dreams, no matter what the cost. Then I heard that mana trees grow at an alarmingly fast rate. I set off to find a mana seed, thinking I could grow a huge mana Christmas tree in no time. <laughs> um, I don't think that's the original line. But the mana power in the seed was too much for my body to handle. It turned me into that monster. One must take care never to abuse mana, or else they'll face the consequences. I apologize for all the fuss. Here, you need this fire seed, correct? Yeah. Now I have to one run all the way back. Feel like wandering through the forests entirely right now. Fighting my way through it, I should say. Maybe just a little. I do need to get some uh, stuff rate leveling consistently. Start using the bow, right? Spending all my healing magic points on uh, killing puffs of smoke in the air. Did we not cast a spell on it? I was about to, like, what's going on in that game? I don't know if it's good or bad that a lot of the game's like same old one off problems actually connecting exist. That was a crit. Let's 
still there. I think we found a bug. You still here, Pebbler? You're from like five areas ago. Get out of here. This should be the cannon. Hey there. Welcome, welcome. It's uh, don't get stranded in the same. Watts is over here. I'm about to. I've been waiting. We didn't use any items, so we just gotta save and refill. I got time. One night is. That was the first time I'd seen a dragon, even a baby one. Me too. Did you get a look at his wings? They're so white. He's got to be the prettiest dragon in the world. Such cute eyes. He's the best. <sighs> What's wrong? You guys haven't stopped gushing since we found that scrawny beast. So? You <laughs> didn't gush at all when you found me in the dwarf village. <laughs> I'm pretty one of a kind too, wouldn't you say? Well, yeah, we did find you in a shoddy sideshow. Oh. And then you tried to cheat us out of our money. Oh. That cute little dragon would never do something like that. Be that way. Hmm. Two levels since the last time I saved. Green. Greeny the ripoff artist. Can register. Let's go. Aww. spider legs at all.
I'm forgetting how long this place is. At least it feels that way. Dungeons do just start getting longer from here on out. Nah, I mean, it's the next game where they added the storage mechanic. This is not the correct room. Your hamsters of doom, they're still a pain. This is what I get for not over leveling the, the woods. I don't have any barrels. I get over there. I want to get over there. Whoa! No way, we're getting past. The flames are too strong. Something else. Do I actually like blow up this one? Is this like the game's actual lock on the palace? Fire. 
What a statue. Just cash. I think some of these rooms are just backup orbs. Big eyes, big eyes balls. Skill. Very soon. I don't even remember getting like the first couple of levels on this, but I remember that like I've definitely been uh, charging. Can't argue with that. Come on, drops. that thing out of here. <sighs> Claws. Well, I mean, they need to get up to level 4 no matter what, right? Well, the boomerang is also low. What are you using? The axe, so you can switch to the glove. No, you should use the whip at this rate. And you're using the sword. You can probably use the bow. Fixing that. Water. Pure water. Nice. It's 
solve that problem just in time. I forget what's down the other passageway from there. I'm going to have to go back and check. the levels are going up. What is the other passage from here? Cash money. Yeah, I'm running around with my like tens of thousands of gold. Plugged in the chest with only a thousand in it. Not a room I want to hang out in with those clouds. Keep it coming. All twenty eight points of damage. This one's on me. The Dark Funk. Got the weapons that are slow to do anything. And that's why it's like if those enemies are in a room, the answer is get out of the way. We got it. <laughs> Later. Thanks for dropping in.
Let's keep this going. Way too many hit points. Passing through this room. I don't want to stay in it very long. I forget what I do with this orb. This might be the Undyne Undine orb. How did Santa get through all this mess? Oh my god, they made him huge. Oh god. Weakness is siphoned, not fears, just weakness. He went down the chimney. Oh, good thought, actually. It's over. Javelin orb. That also went faster than I thought it would. Gotta synchronize with the sea. Hold up the sword animation. That's that. Of course, the other thing that happens now is on the way back. I guess I only have two magic points to throw out there with the sprite. What's the next boss? It's the wall, isn't it? Thank you. 
can't target while the spell's in progress. at a time right now. good for another one. Let's get back to town and wrap up this for today. I'm about to pass up. I've been waiting. Wasn't the seeds? Oh, if only we had a sea hare's tail. Without one, this re this realm, which is like a small place here. my friend. I don't remember her being there. One night is. There's so much sand in the desert. My shoes had more sand than feet in them. I hate sand. Remind me never to visit a desert again. All the moisture in my hair and skin is gone. That's what you're worried about? Skin care aside, it's impossible to sleep with so much riding on our shoulders. You were snoring last night. What was that? N nothing All this desert talk is making my throat bone dry. Ugh. I hate the gritty feeling of sand in my mouth. Water! I need water! What do you need of me? I'm thirsty. You're using magic for that? Understood. I guess Undine's okay with it. Wow. I know I said let's stop there, but I know that the first thing we're going to do is go to the next town and buy equipment. Oh, this is the south town. Let's, let's get to hello, north hello. town. Welcome, welcome. Try to keep a low profile while you're in the Empire. And just pop yourself into the barrel. Yeah, the sewer is mostly blue slimes, right? Empire's lauded South Town. The South Town Northmen. Great team. Oh. 
huh? You're Gemma's friend. See, I'm actually a Tasmanian spy undercover here in the Empire. So was my husband until he got caught with sensitive information. I'm continuing his work. I swear I'll avenge his death. It's the last thing I do. Enter North Town from a sewer passageway east of here. The resistance used to infiltrate the city. Give the guard this secret. 634. Number. 634. That's the only way he'll let you through. My general memory of the situation is to not bother buying equipment here. One night is 100. <sighs> ice country sure was accurately named. Like a winter wonderland with all those chunks of ice and frozen trees. Really cold though. I used to play in the winter part of the forest when I was little, but I was still frozen. Your nose was frozen, and you were sniffing up a storm. Oh. Look, he's talking, Red Nose. You had icicles dripping from your nose. <laughs> it's funnier now than at the time. <laughs> if only we'd had an ice shaver. We could have made enough shaved ice to last a year. My specialty is the rainbow mix of all flavors Ooh. in one. Maybe I'll open up a shop. Who would want to eat shaved ice in that weather? Uh-oh. I haven't thought of that. But now that you mention it, my whole mouth felt numb after just a few bites. So you did eat the snow. Uh. The ice is better in hot climates. Oh, well then I'll just bring the snow down to somewhere warmer. How will you manage that? The snow will melt on the way. But, but no one wants to eat shaved ice when it's cold, and I can't take it with me somewhere warmer. What am I supposed to do about my shop? Aww. A question for the ages. True. All right, we're hosting Jam, and we'll get back to this next time. Six thirty four. Later. <laughs>